In this section, I'd like to show you how to install secondary sites and proxy management points in System Center Configuration Manager. The first step is to configure permissions. So on the TOR-CFG1, I go to the administrative tools and select Computer Management. Then I expand Local Users and Groups and select Groups. I right-click on the administrators and then select Add to Group. In the Administrators Properties dialog box, I click Add and I select Object Types. Then I choose Computers and click OK. Then I type in NYC-CFG1 and click Check Names and click OK. By doing this, I make the central site to be part of the local administrator group on the Toronto computer. Then I close the computer management. The next step is to configure local group memberships on the NYC-CFG1 for site-to-site -site communications. I switch back to my central site, which is NYC-CFG1, switching back to Administrative Tools, Computer Management, expanding Local Users and Groups, and then selecting the group called SMS underscore Site System to Site Server Connection underscore NYC, and select Add to Group. In the SMS Site System to Site Server Connection dialog box, I click Add, and I choose Object Types and select Computers. This time, I type in Torrento Computer, which is TOR-CFG1, and click Check Names and click OK. So by doing this, Torrento will be a member of local administrators on the site server. Then I close this dialog box. I also right-click on the SMS underscore site to site connection NYC and add Torrento computer to that group as well by selecting object types, computers, and typing TOR-CFG1 and clicking check names and clicking OK. Then I close the computer management. In order to install the secondary site, you could do so in two different ways. Either launch the setup program from the media of System Center Configuration Manager or going through the Configuration Manager console, expanding the site database, expanding site management, and select NYC Central Site New York City. By right-clicking at this node, I can select New Secondary Site. On the Wizard page, I click Next. On the Site Identify page, I configure the following option. I specify the site code to be TOR, site name to be secondary, Torrento, and on the site server page, I configure the following settings and then click Next. Site server name to be TOR-CFG1 and the installation directory to be Program Files and Configuration Manager on the C drive. As you can tell, the TOR-CFG1 has no secondary site yet. By doing this, we are installing the secondary site on this computer remotely. On the Installation Source Files page, I verify that Copy and Installation Source Files over the network from the parent site server is selected and click Next. On the Address to Secondary Site page, New Address to Secondary Site page and New Address to Parent Site page, I click Next and I click Next on the Summary and close the wizard. In the Configuration Manager console, I expand the NYC Central Site New York City and click F5 to refresh the console until the Toronto Secondary Site appears. It might take 5 to 10 minutes for an installation to complete. By doing this, I've successfully created a secondary site, which is Toronto, under the primary site, New York City. Remember that the secondary site does not have any database. The next step is to create a site boundary for secondary site, which is located under Toronto. As you already know, secondary sites do not have any management console, so I have to control and manage this secondary site within my central site. Within the NYC-CFG1 Configuration Manager console, I expand Torrento Secondary Site, expand Site Settings, and right-click on the Boundaries and select New Boundary. I specify the following information. Description, Site Code, IP Address Range as a type of a boundary, and a starting address of 10.10.2.1 through 99. By going through this section, I have successfully created a new boundary for Secondary Site on Torrento. In order to install a proxy management point, on the central site computer, I, I launch Configuration Manager Console, and then I expand Site Management, the central site, and the Torrento secondary site. Expand the Site Settings, Site Systems, and select Torrento-CFG1. In the Actions pane, I click New Rows. On the General page, I verify that I specify a fully qualified domain name for this site system on Intranet is selected, and Intranet fully qualified domain name is set to torrento-cfg1.contoso.com. On the System Role selection page, I select Management Point and click Next. In the Default Management Point Configuration message box, I click Yes, and click Next on Management Point page, Summary page, and close the wizard. 
I wait about 5 minutes in order to have enough time for the proxy management point to install on the secondary site server. In order to verify the installation of the proxy management point on the Toronto computer, I navigate to Program Files Configuration Manager and Logs directory and open up mpcontrol.log file. I press Ctrl N to move to the end of the file and press Ctrl F to open a Find dialog box. In the Find dialog box, I search for Successfully Perform Management Point and select Up and then click Find. I verify that at least one Successfully Perform Management Point availability check against local computer entry exists. Then I close this log file. In this section, I verified the installation of the proxy management point on Toronto computer.